Welcome to WARN, today's news is. India's latest submarine, INS Calvary ready for active deterrent patrol in high seas. The Navy is expected to induct its first Scorpeni class submarine, named Calvary, this June, sharpening its underwater warfare capabilities. The submarine is ready to patrol the high seas and protect India's overseas national assets and interest and challenge enemy vessels. This will be followed by the commissioning of the second French-designed diesel-electric attack submarine, Condorie, in December. Calvary and Condori are two of the six Scorpeni submarines being constructed in the country with technology transfer from French firm DCNS under a RS-23-562 crore program called Project 75. The Scorpeni is expected to become the main conventional submarine of the Indian fleet and replace the aging Russian Kilo-class and German HDW vessels that are almost three decades old. The Scorpeni project, plagued by cost overruns and missed deadlines, is important as the Navy's underwater attack capabilities have blunted over time. India operates 13 aging conventional submarines and an Akula II nuclear-powered attack boat leased from Russia. All six submarines are expected to join the Indian fleet over the next three years, with a third boat, Vila, likely to be launched in the coming months. As India gets ready to expand its underwater fleet, HT gives you the lowdown on why building submarines is extremely complex using data accessed from the Navy. Number of MANHOURS to assemble, submarine, 2,500,000 frigate, 1,200,000 Boeing 777, 50,000 tank, 5,500. Assembly parts, submarine, 500,000 frigate, 170,000 Boeing 777, 100,000 tank, 14,000 number of suppliers, submarine, 1,600 frigate, 600 Boeing 777, 550 tank, 600. Number of systems, submarine, 108 frigate, 60 Boeing 777, 40 tank, 25 construction time, in months, submarine, 60 frigate, 22 Boeing 777, 14 tank, 7. Thanks for watching. Please like and share. Please comment your opinion for this news. Press subscribe button for auto update to you regarding my channel world action and reaction news, warn.